It's the final day of inspection and all the teams are making sure they have all their bases covered. After talking with multiple teams, a common thread most of them share is they're racing for someone they love. Team Donate Life Crystal's gift was formed after Crystal Stanford's life was shortened after a biking accident. Her younger sister Callie is crewing on the team and talks about organ donation and living life without regrets. She kind of lived every day as if it was her last and I think that's really important and I know personally it's changed my life. I think it's changed, I think it's changed every person on this team's life because you don't know when you're going to have tomorrow or you're not. And so I think that's really important and be safe and be healthy, but do everything you want to do because that's what my sister did. <laughs> the Georgia chain gang is back for their third year this time with an eight person team. They've lost their friend Warren Bruno a few weeks ago and are dedicating this ride to him and to raise money for leukemia and lymphoma. We hope to come close to a total of half a million dollars between all three years. First two years we raised almost a quarter of a million dollars. As of right now, we're over $150,000 and we usually will raise $40,000, $50,000 during the race. So we're getting close to that goal. Team Donate Life, Achieve and Believe is the youngest team ever to ride Ram. They're all between the ages of 13 and 18. Tiffany Ellison has two kids racing. It's been challenging for a few reasons. One, because her daughter is the only female on the team, and her son Connor has been fighting a liver disease. And it's been so consuming with Connor in the hospital and then in a body cast and seeing his comeback through all of that. You know, there's nothing better as a mom. Just seeing him face adversity head on and still come out on top like that. That's a choice he made for himself. And then his sister, you know, being the only girl on a team. And these guys are fast, and she wasn't a cyclist before. She became a cyclist in September, and now, you know, she is so consistent and so strong and stays with these guys on these crazy hard rides. And, you know, she earned her spot. And as a mom, you know, that's, that's a skill I want my daughter to have, so I'm really proud. So after the final days of inspection, I decided to join Team Believe and Achieve in a little bit of pizza. For Race Across America, I'm Sarah Pila.